hello everyone so in this video I'm going to show you how to run code on GPU and uh, how to run that same code using multiple threads so in this program I'm just going to print a simple message so let me write main function first so what I'm going to do I'm going to print hello from CPU so whatever you will write in main function that code actually is executed by CPU and in case if you want to execute something on GPU so in that case you need to write some special function that function will be written like uh, say hello so this function we are writing for GPU and in this function what we are going to do we are going to print hello from GPU now when we execute this program main function will be executed now how we can transfer execution from CPU to GPU so we need to make a function call but this call is different from the function call which is executed on CPU so here we need to write how many number of blocks you want to create or you want to execute this code on how many number of blocks of threads so in GPU uh, threads are managed in grid of blocks each block can have some particular number of threads so here first you need to specify number of blocks so we are taking only one block and let's say we want to have 10 threads in this block so what will happen now this function will be called by 10 threads so 10 thread will execute this function it means this fun this message will be printed by 10 times so I have saved this file I will open my command prompt move to directory now uh, if I simply use NVCC and I compile this program so while executing this printf will not work this printf in GPU mode will not work so what I'm going to do I'm going to generate executable file for SM20 architecture and okay so there are some error let me see so here we forgot to mention semicolon okay so compilation is successful now a executable file is generated with name a.exe so we will execute that file so if you can see hello from CPU it is executed only one time but hello from GPU is executed 10 times why because here we have uh, made this function to be called by 10 threads so it's up to you how many number of threads you want to create. Thank you very much for watching.